Do you want to get more leads and customers to your website organically? Then you're here to learn the right thing to get you there. Keywords. Hey there, this is Thiago Mazil and I'm a product marketing manager here at one.com. And to get started in today's topic, what is a keyword? Keywords are used to identify the main topics of your page and therefore to define your site's content. But think of a keyword not as a single word, but more as a search phrase. I bet you search things on Google with phrases to get a more refined search, am I right? You get the point, but how to choose a focus keyword? To choose a good keyword, just simply put yourself in your customer's shoes. So think about who your ideal customer is and what they most likely would type to find your products or services. Let's say you have a website and you sell furniture online. Then you should have in mind a keyword for your website in general, like vintage furniture from friends as an example. To optimize your pages for the search results, you need not only to use the right keywords, but you also need to use them strategically and organically in your content. As an example, if you have a physical business, you should add your business location and also add key selling points like free delivery, restoration or customization and any other points that are relevant to your business. The more your keywords matches your customer search phrases, the more your chances are to rank your website in the search results. To help you finding out what people are looking for online, you can use a free tool from Google called Google Trends. From here, you can check which keywords are used more often and you can also select the region you're located for a better result. You know what else is free? Subscribing to our channel to continue to see tips like this one right here. And while you're there, don't forget to leave us a like if you see value in this video. The next point is how to manage your keywords. Here at one.com, you can choose a keyword for each specific page using the SEO scan tool which is available to you on the business and e-commerce tier. After you add a keyword, we will provide you some optimization tasks and guide you through this process so you can get the best out of it. And just as a last tip, avoid repeating a keyword too many times on a page because search engines like Google, for example, might consider it as a spam and therefore not rank your page at all. So instead of repeating a keyword too many times, try using synonyms and different search phrases. This way, you'll manage to keep your pages more user-friendly and have better chances to rank well. I hope you have enjoyed this video and I see you on the next one.